some of the things that we used to see in, in the community, we don't see anymore. Remember the poop explosion was a big to do. Every video was like <laughs> poop, <laughs> poop, throwing up. Um, as disgusting as it may seem, um, it actually was a fun time in the community when people were really into role playing and doing funny things. Um, the other thing was taking babies out for reactions. We all used to take the babies out for reactions. I don't know if people do that still today, but um, I remember I used to take my babies out for reactions and record. And, you know, to be honest, um, the more I got into collecting and the more realistic my babies became, the less fun it was for me to take them out because people didn't notice. People, I had to do things to make them know that it wasn't a real baby. Like, I remember laying a baby up on the conveyor belt at Walmart and the lady, like, saying, you know, freaking out. And then she kept saying, um, is this, is it okay? You know, and then she, I kept telling her it was a doll and she was like, are you sure? Because the baby looks really real, but it's not breathing. Do you need, da, da, da. It was just, like, crazy. And I remember... Um, one time, I don't know, was I, did I have another doll collector with me? It might have been one of my out-of-town trips. I can't remember. Or was it with my kids? I had, um, I had Puck. And I was in the mall. And the lady kept watching us. And then he was in the thing and she said, she kept looking and he looked like he his color was draining a little bit or something i forget it was weird and she said that she never seen his like chest go up and down and so she was she's a nurse she was a nurse and so she came over there and she said hey she said um i just she said have you you know sh sh checked on him you know blah blah i guess oh maybe he didn't move i forget what it was it was crazy so she I said, it's a doll. She said, oh my gosh. She says, I'm a nurse. I'm sorry. She said, I just kept watching because he's really cute. But she just couldn't. She wasn't seeing like movement, I guess, or something. And she thought because I was shopping and not paying attention, you know, you know, it's serious things that happen with real babies like SIDS and stuff like that and whatever. And it was just, it was crazy because she was like so concerned and I don't like scaring people. Now that part, I don't like that. I don't like triggering people with that kind of stuff. But it was kind of interesting. Um, but as time went on, you know, I would take certain babies out and people just would just walk right by. You know, the only thing I would might get is like, um, I remember I had a uh, Jacoby. Was it Jac Jacory? Um, he was a partial I think it was Polly by Rachel Farrell I can't remember but I had him out and the people uh the the guy was like go ahead you can get in front of me you got the baby I know you're probably trying to get out of here before he wakes up and it was hilarious and I, I was I was just kept saying no you go ahead because I knew it wasn't real but I didn't want to make a scene so I just went ahead and went ahead you know there's times where when I had the dog you know, people, the car stopped to let me go cross because I had the baby. Um, one time I had a baby that was painted by Marlon Sweet Dreams. It was an Everlay sculpt. And I had the baby out and I didn't, it was cold and I didn't have socks on it. And an old lady cussed me out. She was like, you know what? She was like, y'all younger girls, young, young girls shouldn't be having babies. It's like babies having babies. That baby need on some salt. That baby gonna have pneumonia and this, that, and the other. And you need to get some salts on that baby or get that baby back in the house. How old is that baby? And this, that, and the other. And I was like, ma'am, it's not a, it's not, it's a doll. She, yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, it's pretty. It's a doll, but it needs to be covered up. And no, it's a real doll. So, after a while, you know, I would have to do things that was drastic. Like, I purposely didn't put the baby on socks in hopes that somebody would say something or notice it. You know, just, or walk off and leave the dog. Stuff like that I would have to do to get attention. So it would be really extreme um, things. Because the, the more the art started evolving and artists started getting better and better at it, the baby started looking so real, 
So you really didn't really get a reaction if you just was carrying on like a normal business. You know, people would walk by and say, oh, she's pretty or he's pretty or oh my gosh or oh, you know, and then they just keep going. They don't think it's not a doll. So that 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 went away. Um, but, you know, I said to myself the other day because where was I took a baby out once. Oh, I used to take them to the hair salon. And I said, you know, I should probably take my babies out more now that I paint because it's like great marketing, actually. But I should take them out more and, you know, just get reactions and see what, you know, people say. I never, and, and I'm not being rude when I say this, but I never really value a non-doll collector or someone that's not familiar with this art opinion as heavy as I do an actual collector because you got to consider that these people have only seen Walmart, Target, you know, those type of dolls, um, manufactured dolls. They've never seen anything like this in sculpting. The sculpting itself is very realistic on our dolls. So just that alone, you could take a very poorly painted doll and the sculpting alone will wow, you know, a lot of people. Um, now, some people, don't get me wrong, they have an eye for color and they, you know, they be spot on and like, oh my God, because I've had people like, I took, um, when I took, when I had Jaden, I took Jaden and they were like, uh, the way his skin looked and this and they were just naming out details and so that, you know, then I kind of consider it a little bit more of a compliment then when they, they were actually noticing different things um and they're calling out different details versus like oh my god it looks so real you know type thing um but I don't know you know I I miss I miss a lot of the little things that I used to be able to do um when I had more time and stuff um and you know the fun fun videos you know I had time to think about them and and create and you know just play you know miss andy and nikki and um uh, mercedes remember the whole puck series i'll never forget the puck series it was so much fun i was off from work um i <laughs> i quit my job and i'd been home and i was just home and i just had time and i would just set up the house and just record and just have fun and you know it was fun i even had a whole fight with a fake person it was you know it was fun um so anyway i would like to know what are, what are some of the things that you miss in the community that you would love to see more of or see come back or what are some of the things that <laughs> maybe you don't miss you know like some people hated the poop explosion uh videos and stuff um i don't know but anyway i just was thinking of that and thought i would come back and talk to you guys but I will see you guys later in the next video. Bye-bye.